Aloha! So I wanted to share with you uh, my latest plans. Um, behind me you see the garden, well one of the gardens here um, at this ranch. And so the weather has been fairly mild here. Um, it's gotten into the 40s at night. And during the day, I think the highest was 79. But um, the bus I'm staying in is not insulated. Um, so it's not a full conversion. And so it's been a bit cold in the middle of the night um, when I need to get up to go pee. And then when I get up in the morning to get dressed, um, it's for me, being in the 60s is <laughs> a little too cold for changing clothes. So I've uh, tried doing different things to make it more insulated by adding some things to cover the windows with um, like blankets and foam insulation and cardboard and blankets. And <laughs> but um, yeah, it's just not quite enough. I've gotten it up maybe a five to ten degrees um, and then at, during the day it gets really hot um, to 101 in there inside even though outside it's only 79 so that's not good for like my laptop and you know things that are sensitive to temperatures like lotions and stuff like that um, and definitely can't keep my dogs in there so I've been keeping them in my truck with the uh, windows cracked um, so I realized, you know what, being in my trailer would be more comfy because at least it's more insulated than this bus, even though it is not as good as, you know, a house, but so I have decided that I'm going to go get my trailer tomorrow instead of waiting, um, till two weeks of being here. And, uh, thank God the owner of this ranch is cool with that. And, um, so, um, it's going to take me four days round trip to do that because I'm about six to seven hours away from where my trailer is now. And, um, yeah, it's going to get down to the thirties here tomorrow night, I believe. And, um, there's going to be rain. So I figured I better, uh, head out before then because in case the roads get uh, messed up by the rain um, there's a lot of washes in this area so um, so I figured it'd just be safer if I try to drive out before the rain so I am gonna be uh, driving through Fort Mojave um, tomorrow staying with a friend from church overnight and then um, then head out the next morning to get my trailer and get it situated and then head back down to Arizona again um, probably overnight somewhere with the trailer um, maybe a Walmart or a truck stop or something and then um, get back here by Sunday and then stay here until I know uh, if I get the internship or uh, able to stay at another intentional community. Um, I'm going to continue researching other ones just in case uh, those two don't um, work out. And uh, that's it for my, my plans for the near future. Um, and if you have any issues that you would like me to help you with, um, I definitely can talk to you over the phone while I'm driving. Um, because like I said, I do have <laughs> over six hours of driving to do and with stopping and everything is going to probably take like nine hours total. So, um, well, that's not including the overnighting thing. So anyway. Um, the people here have been really nice, um, although the owners have been <laughs> away because they uh, had a, a workshop thing that they needed to go to, but um, the other woofers that I 
have been working with here have been really nice and um, plenty of food. I'm like amazed how much food they have here. They have like 10 refrigerators. Um, maybe only a third of them are actually working. So the others are being used for storage of dry goods. Um, but uh, yeah, no shortage of food here, that's for sure. The only thing is being able to find it because it's not very well organized. I mean, it is somewhat, it got things labeled, but then there's other things that are not. And like you find a olive oil over here and another oil over there and it's not all in one spot. So trying to remember is definitely challenging my memory. Um, so anyway, um, so let me know what questions you have. I'm sorry I haven't checked with the comments today. So um, I will do that later on when I take a break from packing up. Um, so uh, mahalo for watching and I can't wait to share with you some more wellness information to help you and your loved ones. So, oh, and please go to my uh, site, uh, bit.ly slash Aloha Jedi. And um, I have, you know, all my services offered there. So please share that with your loved ones. And um, yeah, and I've got a lot of uh, different information there about the things I do. So, so please share it with people so that way I can help them and it also helps me. So until next time, which hopefully will be tomorrow. Oh, by, by the way, um, I haven't done daily videos in the last three days because the Wi-Fi here in the bus is not that strong. So I'm not able to upload stuff there. So I have to go into the main house to do that, which um, I've had a chance to do. Um, well, when I'm in there, I forget to do it because, or because I'm busy cooking or talking or doing other things on the computer. So anyway, I will get to it later today. So see you next time.